joined the Catapult in 2019 after graduating from the University of Glasgow with a Masters in Mechanical Engineering. Today I'm going to be covering the topic of physics and answering the question how does physics contribute to the growth of renewable energy? So to solve any engineering problem we first need to understand the physics behind the problem. I apply my understanding of physics to a lot of the engineering projects that I work on and one of those is called Total Control. This is a large project with multiple project stakeholders and the overall aim is to test and demonstrate multiple methods that can potentially increase the total power captured by wind farms. The methods can also potentially reduce the loads experienced by turbines, increasing their overall lifetime. ORE's role in this project is to demonstrate these methods on our demonstration turbine in Leaf and Mouth, and my role has been to coordinate and monitor these tests. One of the tests that we have carried out looks at wake steering. As wind flows through a turbine, the turbine extracts energy from the wind. Downstream from the turbine, a wake is generated where wind speed is reduced but becomes more turbulent. In a wind farm, when the oncoming wind direction aligns with the rows of turbines, downstream turbines are affected by turbulent, less powerful wind from the wake of upstream turbines. This results in an overall reduced power for the wind farm. Wake steering strategy allows an upstream turbine to be slightly misaligned with the wind direction. This steers their wake away from downstream turbines. The aim of this is to increase the total energy generated from the wind farm, also reducing the loading on downstream turbines. An understanding of physics is crucial to the development of wake steering strategies and other control strategies that can potentially improve the power generation from wind farms contributing to the growth of renewable energy.